Aquarius, it's Elle here to do uh, your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below. Uh, if you need to get in contact with me, let's go ahead and get into this. Thank you, God, for blessing the Aquarius with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so Aquarius, let's see. So we're going to start off with love and then we'll go into career and finance. So everybody wants to know, right? Um, how does my person feel about me? So let's ask that question here. I'm just trying to change something here. One second. All right, there we are. All right, so let's see. How does Aquarius person feel about them? How does the person ooh, the Aquarius is coming to the reading for? You could be dealing with a Scorpio. They feel like the five of, of cups. They feel like they don't know how to get back to you. They don't know how to get the relationship back. They feel like they've done too much in, uh, in order to get forgiveness from you. Um, it says the relationship is recoverable, but you have to do the work to recover it. It's, it also talks about building a bridge to one another because what rests between the two of you, I don't know if you can see that water, uh, that that body of water is supposed to indicate tears suffering sorrow so you can have to build a bridge back to one another over all of that sorrow all that hurt all that pain okay so that's how your person feels they like they knew that they messed over you that there's disappointment here they also regret not saying things to you maybe not telling you how they exactly felt about you they also regret maybe um, going to social events too much or socializing or having more than one option and maybe keeping you as an option here all right how does Aquarius feel about this person how does Aquarius feel about this person right Aquarius is calling judgment on this person here could be dealing with a Scorpio heavily okay or somebody who has Scorpio in their chart don't get hung up on the signs if it sounds like your story then it's your story but don't get too hung up on the signs here all right because we all have so many different signs in our chart so aquarius you feel like you you have to call judgment on this you have to determine if you're going to forgive absolve them of all of their sins all their wrongdoings all the trials that that they put you through you know um, you have to decide uh wow that's crazy look you have to decide, um, Donnell Jones, where you want to be, where I want to be. You have to, and, and the universe is prompting you, to, pushing you like, hey, are you going to stay with this person? Or are you going to allow them to come back? Or are you going to move on with the judgment card? Um, because the ju this is the card before the world when, when the cycle is closed and the universe takes you to another chapter in your life. But the universe wants you to make the decision and the judgment card turns into a two so it's definitely a decision are you gonna really cut this person out what is the advice for aquarius all right what is the advice for aquarius what is the advice for my aquarius collective all right wow the four ones so that's interesting advice aquarius because it, that has many different meanings the four of wands um I'm gonna pull a card on the four of wands. All right, but as I pull a card, I'll talk about the four of wands. The advice is the four of wands. So it talks about roots, groundedness. It uh, talks about feminine energy. So this definitely could be advice for feminine energy. It doesn't have to be a woman. You could be in the same sex relationship, but you could be the feminine one. So uh, it talks about a uh, feminine energy. Um, it talks about monumental achievement. Maybe this could even be telling you Aquarius to go to the next level here achieve something great here M maybe by way of choosing yourself yeah the magician here maybe by taking the power in your own hands uh, speaking your truth maybe even reinventing yourself um this could even be just that you you need to you need to close the door on this maybe you have to turn down you have to, but this this would be like being compassionate and saying no with the four of wands here but at the same time four of wands could talk about reunion you know it could talk about reunion and um, what's this all right I knew it I knew it okay uh, 
So you got a lot of one cards, the magician, the ace of cups. So the universe wants you to close this out and understand that, you know, you can have um, a solid, stable relationship, a marriage, a twin flame, soulmate, life partner. You know, if you decide to look at love differently, maybe to put more love into yourself first, uh, the tears again, and the Ace of Cups or the, the teardrops here. It's like the universe is trying to offer you newness, maybe even stability by way of the world, closing out this cycle, going to the next level. I just wanna be sure, is it that the Aquarius should, with the advice here, should the Aquarius let this go or let this person go? All right, these, okay, these songs are talking. So you got burn coming on. You're just gonna have to, so many things that you can do. And you might think that you gotta let it burn. Just, and, it, and it's almost like you come into some, yeah, you got walking away cards. So the universe wants you to know Aquarius. I know that you are conflicted because this turns into the five of wands within yourself. But they want you to know that the grass is greener with the two of wands on the other side, that you can have expansion. You can have the four of wands. And this stuff can come in rather fast because the wands are, when, it, when you have this many wands in, a, in a, a spread, it talks about fast action, fast movement. It's like, if you decide to walk away from this and go the other way, you'll get the manifestation that you have been waiting for the manifestation of maybe the emperor or husband or a husband like figure um or more stability but you have to take your power back you've been manifesting this aquarius but you really got to close out this cycle maybe with an an old individual an old person maybe they have a little slither of your heart left and the universe really wants you to shut the door if you're done with it. If you're not, it's your choice. It's your life. It's what the universe is saying. So, um, yeah, you might have to just let this burn. It hurts, but you know it's best. You know, maybe this person just hates the, the thought of being of you being with somebody else. And maybe that's why they're holding on. And maybe that's why you're holding on, too. So that might be ego there. Let's see what's going on for career and finance, Aquarius. So we've got the advice there. You need to let this go because there's something so much greater on the other side of it. And it looks like it could come in rather quickly for you if you really close the door, if you really have maturity about this. Learn the lesson here with the world card. Close the book. Not even just go to the next chapter, but close the book. Start a new book here, Aquarius. Let's see. What is what are the messages for career finance for the Aquarius King of Swords? So you could be dealing with somebody in authority or you have the authority here. Um, somebody is good at making decisions because they're attached to the outcome. You could be ambitious right now in your career and your finances. Um, you could be even getting expert help, uh, thinking of going back to school. You, be, you could be becoming a teacher of some sort. Again, expertise. Eight of Wands, something's moving quick in your career finance. Also, it says obstacles will be removed once you get this go ahead, this yes answer, this move forward. Uh, once uh, you start to be ambitious, it looks like there'll be opportunity that you need to take here and you need to act on it fast. It says the law of, tra of attraction. So maybe you're attracting uh, different opportunities to you. You're sending out a lot of um Maybe you're sending out a lot of emails or a lot of phone calls are coming in. Um, you could be interviewing. Uh, it looks like you will get an offer soon made to you, Aquarius. What is this going on? What's this going on? For? Yeah, it looks like you, you're you going to get a, a fair, balanced uh, judgment or uh, answer rendered to you. Yeah, then judgment comes out. Yeah. So this even could be legal here. This could be from your lawyer. There's communication coming back and forth. From your lawyer about or some some professional that has a this could even be court professional this can be of course a lawyer about maybe a legal case or something legal or something that has to do with legal matters um they, they could be making a final decision a final judgment and then there's a payout there six of pentacles this could be 
a loan. This could be money owed to you. This could be investments, but it's uh, it's money given to you, Aquarius. You've got a lot of things you want to do with this money, Aquarius. Seven of Cups. I mean, you think about it over and over again about how, you know, if this could just come in for you, your dreams could come true. You could fulfill some of these dreams. You want to get out of wishful thinking and you want to get into doing. What's the advice for Aquarius in career and finance? And then we'll close it out. Advice for Aquarius, career and finance. Advice okay well, good news is coming aquarius page of wands um it looks like it's coming rather quickly also it looks like you're going to be able to live life on your own terms do what it is you want to do you're going to be able to take flight you're going to be able to take you're going to be able to explore what it is you want in your life yeah you're going to be in some leadership position or role in your life you can take the lead now you can delegate you can make things happen. You could go after some entrepreneurial endeavor. Wow, the sun card. It looks like the universe is lining things up so that you um, can get what you want here with the sun card. This is something about outdoors, a childlike spirit. Maybe you're going to do something that you always wish you could do from childhood. <laughs> Four wands coming up again, Aquarius. Looks like maybe you could do something with real estate. You can move. You could celebrate with family. Um, some monumental uh, achievement happening here for you, landing a big contract or the contract comes in, you sign it, you move on with your life. This looks good, Aquarius. Many blessings to you. Um, get your own personal reading. If you feel like any of this resonated with you, you can go over to the website, book there, ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. Take advantage of some of the specials that are going on right now. Go over to the community tab in YouTube and you'll see all of those different uh, specials. To get one of the coupon codes and then head on over to the website and book. Uh, today is Tuesday. I will be live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday I am live. You can come to the live uh, reading for the collective reading. You can also ask questions, okay? Um, Aquarius, many blessings to you. I don't even know how to say it because you got so many blessings coming in to you, all right? Thank you, Aquarius. Many blessings to you again. Take care.